Josh Robbins, The Athletic. Wendell, welcome to Central Florida. Uh, thank you, thank you. Uh, what uh, what uh, does this opportun opportunity mean for you and what can you accomplish here? Um, you know, it's, uh, it's great to be here. Um, you know, uh, I, I, I came here for a pre-draft workout um, about two years ago now. You know, I, I loved everybody on the coaching staff. I loved all the, the players on the team. And um, you know, it's just funny how the world works. And now that I'm here, um, you know, it's a, a huge opportunity for me to, uh, you know, try to shake some things up for this team, um, try to bring everything that I, that I can do at a very high level, um, just showcase that, you know, just just help this team win. You know, that's, that's really what I'm all about is winning. And, um, I'm just very excited, ready to get going. Dan Savage, OrlandoMagic.com. Wendell, talking to some of the people in Chicago, uh, you know, they mentioned how Otto was part of a, a veteran nucleus along with guys like Thaddeus Young that helped bring along Patrick Williams, Kobe White, you know, guys like yourself. Uh, how much do you think a, a guy like Otto can can help with that here in Orlando? Uh, Otto was one of, he was my favorite, one of my favorite teammates. Uh, while I was at Chicago. And then when I heard that he was coming down here with me, um, I just know he's gonna bring that that, um, that great passion that he has for the game. Him being a vet, been in the league for a while now, been on some winning teams, or well, been on a winning team um, in DC. So he understands what exactly it takes. And um, you know, he's very well mannered, you know, gets along with everybody. So I think that would be um, definitely gonna help us, help this team. Um, you know, we're a very young team, so I think him being around and him knowing knowing the ins and outs of this league is definitely going to help us. Phil Brossman, Reich, Orlando Magic Daily. Um, for for yourself, I mean, I I know it's been a maybe a little bit of an up and ride, up and down ride in Chicago. How much of a change of scenery do you, do you think can can help yourself and then help you kind of get get yourself kind of reset yourself and get get yourself uh, back on track? Uh, it's, I mean, the only time will tell. Um, I'm, I'm just definitely excited. I'm going to. You know, just just going to this thing all the way in. Just try to try to do the best that I can for this team, and you know, with a change of scenery, new new teammates, new coaching staff, new everything. I feel like you know, it's just a kind of like a reset, kind of like getting drafted all over again. You know, just coming to a situation where you know, I can just try to come and help this team win. So you know, I'm just definitely looking forward to it. Josh Robbins, The Athletic. Wendell, uh, the TV broadcast tonight mentioned that you were AAU teammates uh, with Chumo Kiki. Uh, it was news to us, uh, but what's it like uh, to be reunited with him again? Uh, it's great. Um, you know, we, we used to play with each other. Uh, I think we might have been 14, 15 years old. Um, my mom and his mom were really close. They actually still talk to this day. And uh, it just shows how small of a world this basketball world is. You know, uh, you know he ca he came in a year after me, so uh, you know his mom was you know, looking for pointers as a as a as an NBA uh, player's mom now in the league, and you know we, they're going back and forth, and you know just talking about the different situations that we were both in, and now we're in the same city. Uh, you know, it's just exciting, and just can't wait to get on the court with him. I know exactly what he brings to a team. You know, he you know. Everything he did as a kid, you know, he still does it now. Just at a, a very, very high level now. So you know, I'm just very excited to get back on the court with him for sure. It seems like he has a, a basket, a feel for the game, uh, an advanced understanding per game for such a young guy. Is, can you describe what his feel for the game is? Um, you know, ever since he was a kid, he always, in my opinion, seemed ahead of his time. It, it kind of just seemed like uh, you know, the game just kind of came to him very easily. Uh, he was always a great rebounder. Um, he played really well. He had really good patience when he got into the paint, um, which you know I saw the game tonight. He you know, he does that really well. Um, he's always been a very good shooter. You know, taking his shots when it's open, not deferring shots. And uh, you know, he's one of the, he was always our best defender. You know, whenever we played against other great teams, he was always guarding their best player. So you know, he, I feel like he's a pretty well-rounded player, and uh, I'm just looking forward to getting back on the court with him. Okay, we have time for one more. Christos Salta's Sport DNA. Hello, Wendell. 
what is your expectations about your new chapter with the magic and how could you describe the last 24 hours for you? Um, you know, this, you know, like I said before, only time will tell, uh, you know, this, these last 24 hours have been, you know, very, very crazy. Um, I feel like in a good way though, um, new, new, new place, change of scenery, great coach. Um, yeah, it's, it's just a lot been happening in this past 24 hours. So uh, no, I'm just, I'm here now, just trying to stay in the moment, just looking forward to getting on the court with my teammates. So that's really about it. Okay, Wendell, thank you so much.